Hey there, and welcome back to The Witcher 3. Taking a brief break from the main storyline, just because I'm currently working on getting a decent Gwent deck together. Um, that's coming together pretty quickly. Uh, it shouldn't be too, too much of a delay for me. But in the meantime, we're going to do a side mission or two. I'm going to start by doing Following the Thread, which is just here in Novigrad. Let's talk to the supervisor and see what's Don't going on. Wandering around here. Oh yeah? Well, got a beast you need someone to get rid of? I'm here about the notice. Uh, supervisor Lund posted it. Yeah, a beast haunts the outskirts murdering folk. Got them scared to leave their homes after dusk. I'd like to talk to this supervisor. Too bad he don't receive petitioners. So what's he do exactly? Delivers relief on behalf of the city council, flour and groats for the paupers, meaning he don't do it personally. He's got men for that. He himself, he... Uh... Supervisors. Exactly. Typical supervisor. I aim to hunt down this monster. Best hurry, then some other bloke's already after it. Ah, uh, somebody else has taken it. Who took the contract? Didn't see the man. I was just told some brave fool turned up. Any eyewitnesses to these attacks? No, just the bodies. Beast appears only at night. Chooses isolated victims. When do you find the last victim? Just last night. Hubert, a beggar, but a decent man. I'd let him sleep in the shed from time to time. That one on the right. Eustace hasn't come for the corpse yet. It's lying in there where I found it. Oh, we'll go have a look at it. So long. Could be a vampire. That's what I'm guessing. The body will tell us more. Blood's all sucked out. A lesser vampire? Did I call that a what? I know my monsters. Blood, but not human. Monster was wounded. Interesting. Well, let's follow him. The marks of a Garcane or a Flutter. Gotta be an Ekimara. So it's a vampire, indeed. We've already fought in Ekamara. It was a little while ago. Well, let's just follow him. I chose specifically to do this mission. Because I believe that this one has a Witcher that we can find. And you know, it's always fun when we meet another Witcher. So it's actually over here, is where we need to go. And you can hear him, and somebody's already up there. So let's find our vampire oil. Do a quick read up on our Ekmara's Devil's Puff Ball and Fire. We have Devil's Puff Ball right here. And beautiful. Let's get up here. It's not happy. And there's another Witcher here, Lambert. Greetings, Lambert. Damn, it's good to see you, Wolf. Decide to do some hunting in Novigrad? For as I remember, you never liked this city. Still don't. Thing is, I got a certain matter to take care of. What have you been up to? Any luck on the path? A lot, in fact. 
Quite the takings in Lan Exeter. Was asked to hunt down a giant who turned out to be a forest troll and some bandits. Bandits? Came as a package with the troll. The matter you mentioned. Anything I can help with? Hmm. Maybe. But we'll talk about that later. Got a reward to collect. I'm kinda in a hurry. Let's say you've earned half. What the hell? Sweet, let's go. Let's go. It's always fun to be working with another Witcher. Makes life a whole lot easier. So? What do you think? We did what we had to do. Time to pay up. Wait here, I'll go see the supervisor and get your reward. Do that ourselves. No reason you should abandon your post. Hmm. Hmm. Can't argue with reason. Go on in. We dealt with the monster at the docks. Here for our reward. Witches? Since when do you travel in pairs? Since today. Our dangers lie in wait for a lone witcher. Bandits, for example. I advise you to change your tone. Where's Yad Karadin? Talk. Who? Oh. The hell are you after? Oh, my control is disconnected. Big sad. But I'll reconnect the damn thing. There we go. Who? Trust me, Geralt, this is important. There's something I gotta know. I do not know any Karadin. Take your coin for the before and bugger off before I lose my temper. Where's Yad Karadin? Asking you for the last time. Guards! To the dungeon with them! Oh, you could try, mate. Let Lambert go deal with the supervisor. We'll deal with these clowns. Gentlemen, there is a easier way of dealing with this. But clearly you don't want to. Uh, yes, odd sweep makes quick work of when you're surrounded. Well, let's go in here. Lambert, what the hell are you doing? Sky's more trouble than the Yakimara. Karadin's disappeared. I swear. The others too. Uh, I only know of Vienne. What about Vienne? She drinks at the Seven Cats. They're day and night. See? You can be helpful. Uh, what's going on, Lambert? Murder. Was that really necessary? Yes. More guardsmen will show soon. Let's go. Meet me at the Seven Cats. Tell you everything there. The Tavern VN frequents? Yeah. See you later. So we will always help out a Witcher brother. We're all in this together, after all. If we don't look after each other, who will? So let's go meet Lambert. We've already been to the Seven Cats. That's where, um, we took, uh, Rose Vatra a little while ago. When she decided to run off. Oh, in between cuts. While I was getting my Gwent deck together, I actually did increase roaches, saddlebags, so we got a larger carrying capacity. Alright, high time you explain some things. Why do you kill Lund? What's this all about? Want the short version or the long one? Uh, we want to hear it, everything. Let me hear the whole thing. I had a friend. Aiden was his name. You had a friend? Oh, you fucking hilarious. 
I met him soon after I'd accepted a contract to lift the curse from the Ogre of Elander. Aiden had been hired to kill it. He was a witcher from the School of the Cat. Right? As far as I remember, the Ogre was killed in the end. Yeah. After it gutted my employer, we really didn't have a choice. I cut a deal with Aiden. We joined forces, split the reward for killing the Ogre between us. After that, we worked together a lot. Hands down the best man I'd ever met. I mean, I like you, you know that. Still, no comparison. What happened to him? Some time ago, Aiden took on a contract to lift a curse off a duke's daughter. It was a political mess from the start. Then there was hatred for the School of the Cat to deal with. They worked hard to deserve that hate. Basically turned hired assassins. Aiden wasn't like that. Anyway, some of the Duke's courtiers had designs. Weren't at all keen on the curse being lifted from the Duke's firstborn. So a band of trained assassins ambushed Aiden. Murdered him. Our dear supervisor was one of them. And Yad Karadin? The assassin's leader. And the one to deal the mortal blow. Sorry about your friend. Don't need your sympathy. Just your help. We have to talk to Vien. That we can do. Must have had enough to drink by now. Let's go. Lead on, Lambert. Vien. What do you want? We want to see Yad Karadin. <laughs> now, why would I help you? Because we're asking nicely. Be important to my friend here. And what will I get out of it? Pay for your beer, for starters. Then we'll see how valuable your information is. More like you'll keep your head. I was part of Caradin's band, but when was that? I don't know where to find him. I've fallen out with the lot. Besides, he's no longer chummy with his old mates. Word around town is he's changed. Changed how? Changed? What do you mean? He's dropped all his old connections. Stopped taking on petty killings. He's hidden himself away in some hole. Must be planning something big. Who else was in Keridan's band? Aside from me, Sleaze, Hammond, and Lund, but they've scattered all over the world. Sleaze went to Tretigal, Hammond to Skellige, and Lund. Lund's dead. <laughs> Finally met his match. <laughs> well, you've only Hammond or Sleaze to talk to then. Okay, we need to contact the others. Satisfied? She doesn't know anything. We need to talk to Hammond and Sleaze. Don't go looking for Karazin. If he senses you nipping at his heels, he'll kill you without batting an eye. We'll see. As for you. You do what you think is right. You think's right, Lambert. Not here to preach morals. <laughs> do what you think is right? Only one thing worse than cold blooded murder hypocrisy. Informers, racist snitches. Vien, bloody hell, what is it? Oh they god, no, here we go. Aaron. I told you someone would, sooner or later. Nessa tear. Shit. Didn't see this coming. My game sound working? Nope, there it is. <laughs> I'll leave Lambert to deal with Vian. You gotta help me, Geralt. Best thing will be to split up. 
You sail to Skellige. Try to squeeze something out of Hammond. I'll go to Tredegor and meet with Selyse. Sounds like a plan. Where we meet once I'm back. At the Nowhere Inn. All right, I'm off. Good luck. Okay, we will deal with Hammond later. For now, let's get on to the mystery of the Byway murders. On my tracks, complaining at Velen, I've already come across the Byway down here. So let's get down here and clear the area of ghouls. We were pretty uh, high level when um, I first came through, but we should be should be all right to take them on now. I say that though, and they're still pretty up there. Damn you! Not that they're impossible to kill, it's just really difficult. Kind of just have to keep on the move. Time your attacks. And try not to die. We might be pretty under-geared, under-leveled for this bit. But we should be able to take on the ghouls if I'm careful. Come on, ghoul boy. Your friends are all dead, you got no chance. Oh man. That was tough. There. You can come out. It's safe now. And now I can breathe a sigh of relief. Sure. What happened? Nuff guardians came plundering, looking for valuables, as if we was rich. Who killed them? Couldn't have been you. Uh, I don't know. Must have been those beasts you slaughtered. Never seen ghouls do that. This be the first time ghouls came to help out a village in trouble. At this rate, they'll be taking jobs off the notice boards before long. Was how it was. Wait well on it. Because we're very nosy. We're hiding something. Gonna find out what it is. There's not here. Black ones didn't even find anything. Out of my way. That's what people forget. We're not the black ones. We're a witcher. We'll find everything. 
or like an advanced dog. Sniff everything out. Get out of the way. Come in here. We can loot up. What we're looking for is one of the houses as a trapdoor. Thrown to the ground with great force. Internal hemorrhaging. There is an underground cavern system that's got a vampire. Dog to bits. Soldiers died some other way. Jaws strong enough to crush armor. Scent of blood still strong. Ought to follow it. So, uh, this leads just to here. I don't know how you can smell blood, but it's impressive to say the least. There's nothing there. Tracks lead to this house. What happened here? What do you mean, what happened? Look, you're still in danger. Tell us. Danger, and only I can help. I'm the only one who can rid you of this threat. What do I know? Listen, you. If you don't tell me everything you know, you could all die. Understand? Is that a burden you can live with? There's tunnels beneath the village. Tunnels? Elven ruins. We scavenge them for trinkets, small treasures. Sell them to Novigrad merchants. No one expected anything bad to come of it. We dug through some rubble. Found a chamber. The beast slept inside. We felled the prop so the ceiling had collapsed. Didn't bury the monster, though. Mm, what did it look like? What did the monster look like? It were dark down below. Couldn't see. So how did it kill the North Guardians? I ran. Couldn't watch it happen. Give me the key to the door. You'd go in. No, want to pour wax through its head, tell you your fortune. Now give me the key. So, correct me if I'm wrong. You dug through to the monster's lair, then buried the entrance, but the Nuffgardians opened it again to look for treasure. Beast killed the Black Ones and returned to its lair. You wanted to bury the corpses, but their stench lured ghouls to the village. Now I'm here. Sound about right? Tis as you say. Yes. I'm going down there. If I'm gone long, run. Barring the door, nailing it shut resolves nothing. There are other ways out of the tunnels. Gotta be. Okay. Into the den we go. Hmm. Planks can be lifted. This will be a one-way trip for a little while. Should be a vampire. What? Oh, shouldn't a fall? This is not a fall. Fall. Should be a vampire. I'm pretty sure. Armor pierced. Arteries torn open. An Ekimara. Hibernated here till the villagers woke it. So yes, it is a vampire. It's got devil's puffball, igni, and vampire oil. It's going to be our go-to's. We've got everything equipped. Let's slap on the vampire oil. Let's go mess this thing up. And here it is. Hello, gorgeous. Let's see, do- what do I have equipped? Black blood. Black blood will be semi-useful. Let's eat that. Oh. 
Easy. Vampires, nothing that stands against us. And that is why we come prepared with all our potions, oils, etc. Everything in this game has a use. Let's see, what do you have? Oh, Enhanced Blizzard. Kind of a nice find. Let's just loot up all the herbs down here. Just save us the hassle. And save us a little bit of money. So that is this mission complete, which also completes this episode. We will continue to help Lambert. The next area will be in Skellige, so it'll be quite a ways off before we ever deal with him again. Well, let's go talk to this guy. What's his name? Bidamir. What's up, buddy? Gods, he lives. Found an Ekimara hibernating underground. It was old. Must have been asleep for centuries. An Ekimara? Vampire. Won't trouble you again. You cut off its head, drive a stake through its heart. Did what I had to. Don't go down into those tunnels anymore. Ekimara aren't known to be loners. We didn't hire you. Still. Seems you deserve a... You bet I do. Pay up. Farewell. So forceful. We are a fearless vampire slayer. Let us return back to Oriton and collect a double reward from the Nilfgaard patrol commander. And we will end the episode. Okay, that's a good paycheck too. If it weren't for our peril, what brings you here? We are here about the contract. Saw your notice. Can anyone tell me about the monster? I can. The patrol has been locked. What? Ah, but we already some brick done all this. Been to buy. There we go. We've been to buy ways. This is why they did not return. Eki Mari are tough. Even for a group of soldiers. We will bury them with honors. There we go. Thanks for the cash. Decent little bit of XP as well. And that's going to be it for this episode. If you enjoyed, hit the be sure to hit the like, subscribe, post a comment, let me know what you think. And I'll see you in the next one where we will continue on with the main storyline. So thanks for tuning in. Take care for now. Bye-bye.